Alright, my beautiful Pisces, Pisces, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, Sign, Cross, Watchers, Third Parties. It's your girl, Jessica, Trusting True Tarot, also known as CTT Intuitive. Thank you guys so much for going over there, checking out my second channel, my pick a card readings, my pick a power readings, my pick an item readings, which is in the description box below. I want to thank you guys so much for all your love and support to this channel and my second channel. And I also want to thank you guys so much for being patient with me as I kind of like readjust with this hurricane, Helena. Um, I'm just trying to adjust back to things here. You know, it is kind of a little crazy outside right now, but I have power and I'm going to deliver these messages to you guys, okay? All right, so this is going to be, how do they feel about you, Pisces? How are they coming towards you? What's on their mind right now when it comes to you? I'm going to let you know a little bit of things that you should know about this person. So go ahead and put this person on your mind, okay? And I'm going to let you know how this person is feeling about you. How is this person feeling about Pisces? I don't know why, but I kind of heard a little whisper saying in depth. So I'm not sure. I'm not sure until I get into this reading. I don't know if Spirit wants me to go in depth or maybe there's going to be something that pops up. Let's see how far. Um or how much I get out of this channel, uh, I might go in debt. So let's see here. Let's see, how is this person feeling about Pisces right now? Pisces, go ahead and put this person on your mind so I can let you know how this person is feeling about you. If you need to pause, pause to kind of like think about this person or who you want this person to be. This is a timeless reading. I'm going to let you know how this person is feeling about you. What's this person's story when it comes to my beautiful Pisces that they may not be telling Pisces at this time? So we have the magician here in reverse, Pisces. We have the magician here in reverse. This could be a Scorpio, you guys, all right? I do feel like this is somebody, their story here, let's speak, of, let's just talk about the story. This is somebody that has not changed. This is someone that is potentially, it feels like this person can be very manipulative. So I just kind of feel like this person is very manipulative and I feel like this person hasn't changed. For some of you guys, I feel like this person is all about their own desires. Um, so let's see here. What's on this person's mind when it comes to you? I was just saying they're all about their own desires. <laughs> we have the king of pentacles in reverse. So yeah, this person is giving me, <laughs> this is somebody that's like, they'll do whatever it takes to get something that they desire. I feel like what's on this person's mind when it comes to you is rushing towards you, or it's maybe sex, or maybe passion, or it's like they're wanting, they're, they're thinking about like they really want to come towards you. They really want to rush in right now, um, but it is on something very manipulative or to manipulate you in a situation, okay? How are they feeling deep down inside about you right now? Yeah, I feel like deep down inside, this person may be wanting to talk to you, communicate with you. Um, they're indecisive if you're going to fall for something here uh, that they have planned or that they're trying to make happen. I feel like deep down inside, they feel like you're not going to go for something here or you may not agree to something here that they're about to say to you next, you may not go for it. I'm hearing you're, you're not going to fall for it or you're not going to agree to it or it's going to be, they feel deep down inside, it's going to be very hard to convince you of something here. Let's see, how are they coming towards you right now? Eight of Swords here in reverse. I feel like this person is, the way they're coming towards you right now, they're trying to stay optimistic about something here. They're trying to think positive about it, okay? They're trying to release themselves from any restrictions or doubts that they may have in their mind in order for this to manifest, in order for this to happen, outside influencing how they feel about you. We have the moon in reverse, which is like deception, okay? Could be a cancer or a Pisces. I feel like outside influencing how they feel about you is that you may you may read it's like you may see right through them is what i'm hearing 
they they outside influencing how they feel about the situation is that they feel like you may see right through them or you may read right through them like they 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 may be it's like they're afraid that you're going to see right through them what's their next move towards you the lovers the lovers has a lot to do with some type of decision here um I feel like this person's intentions isn't pure. That's the truth. I feel like this person doesn't have some type of pure intentions when it comes to you. I feel like this person is trying to come up with separation here with you or connect with you. Okay, what's the heart of how they're feeling about this? I feel like the heart of how this person is feeling about you uh, is the truth that this person, I feel like they know that they're not going in the, they know that they're not moving in the direction that you desire. They know that they do not want the same things that you want. The heart of how they feel about you is that you and them are not moving in the same directions, that you guys are both not wanting the same things. They know this. Queen of Cups in reverse. And then the Ace of Wands in reverse. This person may be someone who wants a new passionate start here with you, but they may be leading you on as if they want a relationship or a potential relationship. What's causing this? We have the Six of Pentacles. And we have the stars. So it's like they're giving you some type of hope in this situation. Someone's giving, it's like a false impression, or someone's giving you some type of hope in the situation here with you and them. Like, I don't know, it's some type of false impression. They're giving you this false impression. They're giving you some type of hope. But I don't feel like it's real. It's manipulative. How should Pisces be coming towards this person? Two cards up, right? Eight of Cups is walking away. And the Magician, y'all. The Hierophant. Yeah, I feel like if somebody's in the devil right here in the back. I feel like spirit is saying, walk away from this. Walk away from this manipulative energy. You need to walk away from this. You need to be strong. The 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 magician here is letting me know you need to be strong enough to walk away from this person. And the higher thing is you need to respect yourself. You need to respect your values. You need to respect your principles. Okay? You know what you deserve. You know what you want. And if this person can't give it to you, I feel like you should walk away. The Eight of Cups is you walking away from something here with the magician and having that power to do it, having that strength, taking your power back. I'm getting that spirit wants you to walk away and take your power back. Spirit is wanting you to walk away from this person and they want you to take your power back from this person. I hope this helps and assists you guys in some way. I love you and until next time.